As far as we remember, Prof. Shi Seng Li, a top Chinese virologist, denied the allegation of having gain-of-function experiment in one laboratory. Contradicting to her statement and WHO's investigation into the origins of COVID-19, a new video reveals that living bats were kept in cages inside one institute of virology. The footage shows that Wuhan Love studied live bats despite claims of World Health Organization that such thing was a conspiracy. In December 2020, WHO member and zoologist Dr. Peter Dash Hack has tweets referring to Love Lake as conspiracy theory only. No bats were sent to Wuhan Love for genetic analysis of viruses collected in the field. That's now how this science works. We collect bat samples, send them to the lab, we release bats where we catch them. This is a widely circulated conspiracy theory. This piece describes work I'm the lead on and labs I've collaborated with for 15 years. They do not have live or dead bats in them. There is no evidence anywhere that this happened. It's an error I hope will be corrected. But now, after the official footage of May 2017 was shown to the public, Dasak revised his denials by telling the public on Twitter that WHO had not asked the Institute if they house bats. Most scientists before believed that COVID-19 is transmitted from bats to people with an unknown link. But the love leak theory shows that it may be intentional. The footage is now an evidence of the possibility that one of those viruses have escaped, perhaps after a gain-of-function experiment that rendered it more dangerous. I am Lovely Montoya of Manila STV.